Today let's see how to traverse the DOM structure using jQuery methods. For previous day videos, please visit technotip.com and jQuery section. This is a continuation video in our jQuery tutorial series. So please visit technotip.com for previous day videos. And for future videos, please subscribe to our free email update on our blog. Also subscribe to our YouTube channel. So continuing with the DOM free traversal using jQuery methods. There are some simple verbs to remember like next, previous, children, parent, siblings, etc. These are the simple things you need to remember in order to traverse across this HTML DOM structure you have. The same thing applies even for the XML data. You could fetch the siblings or the next and parent sections. Coming to the coding part now, the children method of jQuery. If you select the OL that is the ordered list and call the children's, you would get these three list items that is Apple, Oracle and Microsoft. Please look at the structure of this HTML. You have a pair main div tag. Inside that, you have image and ordered list. So, ordered list again have three elements that is, list items, three list items. We need to look at this image and ordered list are in the same level and these list items are in another level and all these are in same levels that is the list items are in one level and oil and image are in another level if you select the oracle here the list item give it an id of o select li pound o dot siblings you would get apple and microsoft these are the siblings if you select OL and call siblings, you would get the image here. That is the image tag here. It's as simple. It would select all the elements in the same level. Look at these elements and just call the next here. Now I would I will give an ID of A to Apple, an ID of O to Oracle, an ID of M to Microsoft. Now I would select the ID O that is Oracle and call the next method which would give me Microsoft. To test it out, do you also see this previous? Select the ID with O and call previous, you would get Apple. In jQuery programming, do it with and click off a button and test for all those things. Now calling the parent of OL you would get the due tag. Calling the parent of IMG you would again get the due tag because parent for both IMG and ordered list is due itself. Because IMG and OL are in the same levels it would have the same parent. To test all this out, please look at our previous videos and know how to write basic programs so that you could use all these methods and test it out yourself. Keep it all simple, take a button and call all these functions for click of a button. Look at all these methods individually, don't dump all these methods in one, one call itself. Now calling the empty, select OL, in a web page it would, it would display Apple, Oracle and Microsoft and a button. For click of a button write the above code, select the O tag and call empty that would remove the string present inside this list item with an ID O. So you would get only Apple and Microsoft after clicking the button.
Now let me take some more complex structure here. First we have an OL tag inside that two list items with ID A and M. The third one being the web. Inside that we have another OL. Inside that we have two IDs list items. Now select the G ID, call the closest method and pass the OL method. That would return you the closest OL to the list item with an ID G. Now let us see the chain methods that is hope we had seen chain methods in our previous videos too but let's see how it works now select the id with g all parent you would get o l that is the ordered list tag now the chain method call the parent method of o l that is l i with an id web Please do not get confused with this. The parent tag of OL is not the external OL. People get confused with that. Let's get back and see it again once more. Select the list item with ID G. Its parent is OL and its parent is LI with an ID web. Now let's call next and previous method on this if you call previous to this you would get apple just press back select g its parent is oil its parent is li and its previous sibling is apple calling the next select g its parent is oil its parent is li with an id of web its next sibling is the list item with an id m that is microphone so this is how the traversal works you could call combine these methods and use the chain methods to accomplish your tasks that is the dom tree traversal the document object model traversal using jquery methods Thanks for watching this video. Please share it with your friends on Facebook, Google Plus, Twitter, LinkedIn, etc. And subscribe to our blog technotip.com, also to our YouTube channel and like it on YouTube. Thank you.